Morning Wolf Pack. I'm Paul Vargas. And I'm Noah C. Today is Monday, February 28th, and we're here with your morning announcement. Is there a teacher on campus that you want to recognize for demonstrating our IMCO principles? If so, stop by the leadership room and fill out IMCO teacher edition slip. That teacher will be then entered into a drawing for the next staff meeting. Seniors, just a reminder that this Wednesday, March 2nd, is the deadline to submit your FAFSA or CATA application. You need to fill out these applications in order to receive the first two years of community college free or to receive scholarships or other financial aid. If you have any questions or need more information, contact Ms. Abby or stop by the Career Center. The Serve to Change Live Speech Contest applications are now open. Applications are due this Friday, March 4th, and the actual contest is next Thursday, March 10th at 6 p.m. Check your Synergy email for more information. Attention all club advisors, today and this Wednesday from 3.30 to 4.30 p.m. are your last chances to get a club picture taken for the yearbook. Club presidents must sign up for a time slot using the spreadsheet sent out to all club leaders. Please be on time wearing your club shirt and have a sign with your first and last name written in large print with a Sharpie. Hey Noah, did you feel how warm it was yesterday compared to last week? I sure did. In fact, let's pass it on over to Sterling to see if the warmer weather is here to stay. Sterling, and I'm here with your weather update. Today we can ex expect a high of 74 degrees with a low of 42 and light winds going northwest at about 5 to 10 miles an hour and 50% humidity. For the first half of the week, temp high temperatures are expected to be in the mid-70s with lows in the low 40s. And for the back half of the week, the highs are expected to be in the low 60s with lows in the 30s. And on Thursday, don't forget an umbrella because there's a 67% chance of rain. Well, that's all I have for you today, humans. Back to the other humans. Well, I guess spring is almost here. Thanks, human. BSU is hosting a book reading today after school in the library at 4 p.m. So they will be reading Dear Justice. All are welcome. Congratulations to the following students shown on the screen for winning the library's Black History Month book art contest. <coughs> be sure to stop by the library to pick up your prize. The library will be closed during both lunches next Tuesday through Thursday, March 8th through 10th due to term three textbook returns. The library will still be open the mor in the mornings and after school. To help raise money for junior prom this year, Culinary is hosting a fundraiser dinner. Tickets can be purchased in the student store or with the school site controller. With the purchase of a dinner, you will also get a prom ticket. There will only be 100 spaces available for dinner, so get your tickets fast. Email Mrs. Henderson for more information. Do you need an easy dinner option before an event or practice? Well, you're in luck because the Culinary Department and the CO softball teams have teamed up to create a drive through family dinner for six for $40. You must pre-order by this Wednesday, March 2nd. Dinner includes a delicious pasta bake of your choosing, a crisp Caesar salad with house-made dressing, and French rosemary parka rolls. There is a limited number of dinners that are available to be sure, so be sure to receive uh, to reserve your dinner ASAP. Man, all this talk about food is really making me hungry. How about you, Noah? Definitely. Speaking of food, let's check out this week's Cooking with the Pack. Welcome back to Cooking with the Pack. I'm your host, Joy. And I'm Cooper. And today, in honor of the Super Bowl, we are going to be making sliders. Now, this is a mixture of one-third pork and two-thirds beef. And right now, we have a pan that's on about medium high. We just put in, well, this is a nonstick pan, but if you don't have one, we'll put in some olive oil. And we just form the patties, put them on the pan, squeeze them a bit, and with the pork, it's going to make a nice, juicy patty. So these are gonna cook for three to four minutes on each side, and we have a spatula. Once they get ready, you can flip them. And also, depending on your likeness, some of you guys may like a medium rare patty, some of you guys may like a well done, and it just depends on what you're liking. Yeah. No, you're good. What do you want? Hmm? What do you want? I don't know. I could flip it. Flip. Yay! Oh, yeah. And you have that nice caramelized.
caramelization going on from the juices of the meat. I love burgers, in case you can't tell. We're gonna let this go on for about another three to four minutes. And we're gonna get another patty in. And since the pan is pretty big, you can probably fit a little mini patty. And we have some sliced mozzarella cheese to place on top once the beef is done. Beef and pork. Alright, so we got our sliders nice and cooked. Now we gotta cook some onions. And we like to uh, cook the sliders first just to make sure all the juices can also get in with the onion. So we're gonna go ahead and oh, yeah. pour that on our pan. We're gonna wait until they're nice and like caramelized. Yep, that's the word, caramelized. We're just going to take the patties, as you can see, some of the cheese has melted. Oh, but first, before I do that, we have this barbecue sauce, homemade. 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 I think. I think. Oh. And we're just gonna drizzle that on. And then we have some homemade coleslaw. And we're also just going to add on. And then we're gonna take the burger. Don't worry, my hands are clean. And then the onions. Yes, this is cross contamination, but that's okay. That's okay. And then we're gonna take the little slider back, put it on top. And there you have it your slider. Thanks for cooking with the pack. Go Rams. Boo! <laughs> Man, that looks really good. Well, that's all we have for you today, Wolf Pack. I'm Noah C. And I'm Paul Vargas. And remember, the strength of the pack is the wolf. And the strength of the wolf is the pack. Happy, Happy National, National Chocolate, Chocolate Souffle Day, Wolf Pack. pack.